President Joe Biden has warned Russia's Vladimir Putin that the U.S. could impose new sanctions against Russia if it takes further military action against Ukraine, while Putin responded that such a U.S. move could lead to a complete rupture of ties between the nations. The two leaders spoke frankly for nearly an hour Thursday amid growing alarm over Russia's troop buildup near Ukraine, a crisis that has deepened as the Kremlin has stiffened its insistence on border security guarantees and test-fired hypersonic missiles to underscore its demands. Further U.S. sanctions would be a colossal mistake that would entail grave consequences, said Putin's foreign affairs advisor Yuri Ashikov, who briefed reporters in Moscow after the Biden-Putin phone conversation. He added that Putin told Biden that Russia would act as the U.S. would if offensive weapons were deployed near American borders. White House officials offered a far more muted post-call readout, suggesting the leaders agreed there are areas where the two sides can make meaningful progress, but also differences that might be impossible to resolve. White House Press Secretary Jen Psaki said Biden urged Russia to de-escalate tensions with Ukraine and made clear that the United States and its allies and partners will respond decisively if Russia further invades Ukraine. Putin requested the call, the second between the leaders this month, ahead of scheduled talks between senior U.S. and Russian officials January 9th and 10th in Geneva. The Geneva talks will be followed by a meeting of the Russian NATO Council on January 12th and negotiations at the Organization for Security and Cooperation in Europe in Vienna on January 13th. White House officials said Thursday's call lasted 50 minutes, ending after midnight in Moscow. Biden told Putin the two powers now face two paths, diplomacy or American deterrence through sanctions, according to a senior administration official. Biden said the route taken, according to the official who briefed reporters on the condition of anonymity, will depend on Russia's actions in the period ahead.